Good day and hello everyone, my name is Richard and I want to welcome you back to push-ups for PTSD day 1599 where I'm looking to raise awareness for PTSD and mental health. I don't really have much to say today but honestly I'm gonna put it out there right now. I just heard about a sweet mac and cheese that's been released in Canada for Valentine's Day and the idea of it sounds absolutely disgusting. I've literally heard about it about 30 seconds ago, so I've decided I have to tell everyone. Whoever is thinking about buying this, don't. You don't have sweet mac and cheese. Anyways, there's two things I'd like you to comment below. First, an idea for the next incentive goal. I really don't have one. Um, I'm hoping to get more spicy stuff in, but that's going to have to wait till February before I order it. Uh, Second, do you have a charity that you'd like me to focus on for February that deals with PTSD or mental health or a combination of the two? Because it's the 27th, that means today is day 27 for the monthly goal and day 6 for the new 10 day goal to raise awareness and maybe some donations for wounded warriors. We're doing actually really well. We're on par for with both views and likes. So halfway through. Uh, overall, so from the last five days, we're pretty much right dead even. Remember, every day is a battle, but you've made it this far, which means every day has been a victory. You're undefeated against yourself, so keep going. Next, I want you to know that I am here for you. You're not alone. You're worthy and deserving of both love and respect, and you do not need to apologize for your illness. There are treatments available. Please seek help if you need it. If you don't know where to go, I do have links and phone numbers in the description below to services around the world. The charity of this month, as you all know, that I'm supporting is Wounded Warriors Canada. So half of anything I make through Patreon or YouTube, if I, we ever get that, uh, that far on, will go towards them. Wounded Warriors Canada is a national mental health service provider utilizing clinical best practices and evidence-informed care to create an environment of compassion, resiliency, and hope for Canada's veterans first responders, and their families. I will say, now that we're nearly done the video, today's sets were difficult. I managed to get one set on the high resistance, as you can see, then had to drop back, both due to muscular fatigue and because it was causing an unusual pain in my wrist. The code word today is tired, because I've been tired for the last few days. If you'd like to donate to the monthly charity and my efforts, please visit my Patreon page. There's a link to it in the description below and pretty much everywhere else I can have it posted. I hope you're all doing well. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe. Stay strong. And most importantly, thank you for surviving.